NVIDIA. It offers some of the most advanced and efficient GPUs for AI workloads. These GPUs provide the computational power necessary to train and run complex AI models, essential for developing cutting-edge AI applications. In this video, we'll explore the technology behind NVIDIA, understand its recent surge, and examine its dominance in the AI industry. So, let's get started. NVIDIA's recent surge in value can be attributed to two key factors its dominance in AI hardware, and its strong software ecosystem. NVIDIA's GPUs are exceptionally well-suited for the complex calculations needed for AI applications. This has made NVIDIA the leading provider of the crucial hardware powering the AI boom. In addition to hardware, NVIDIA has also built a robust software ecosystem called CUDA. CUDA makes it easier for developers to build and deploy all applications on their GPUs. Now, I have explained the basics of GPUs in my previous video covering why they are important, their architecture and how they differ from CPUs. If you need a refresher, please check that out. One of the primary reasons for using GPUs is their powerful parallel processing capabilities. GPUs are designed with thousands of smaller, more efficient cores compared to CPUs, which typically have fewer, more powerful cores. This allows GPUs to excel at parallel processing where many calculations are performed simultaneously. AI tasks, especially training deep learning models, involve processing vast amount of data and performing numerous repetitive calculations. GPU's parallel architecture make them perfectly suited for handling these parallel workloads efficiently. NVIDIA's GPUs are particularly well suited for AI calculations due to their unique architecture and feature. NVIDIA GPUs have specialized cores called tensor cores, optimized for matrix operations, which are fundamental to AI calculations. These cores accelerate matrix multiplications and additions, significantly speeding up AI training and inference. GPUs also have high memory bandwidth, enabling them to quickly transfer data between memory and processing units. This is crucial for AI tasks that involve large data sets, ensuring smooth and efficient computation. GPUs are also designed for high floating point performance, which is essential for the numerical calculations used in AI algorithms. They can handle a vast number of floating point operations per second, allowing for faster AI model training and execution. Now, NVIDIA's CUDA platform provides a comprehensive set of software libraries, tools, and APIs, especially for GPU-accelerated computing. This allows developers to easily harness the power of GPUs for AI applications, reducing development time and complexity. CUDA includes optimized libraries for deep learning frameworks like TensorFlow and PyTorch, further enhancing the performance of AI workloads on NVIDIA GPUs. The combination of parallel processing, specialized hardware, and strong software ecosystem has made NVIDIA GPUs the preferred choice for various AI applications. GPUs are used to train massive AI models with billions of parameters, such as language models and image recognition models. GPUs also enable real-time AI inference, allowing AI systems to make quick decisions and predictions in applications like autonomous vehicles, robotics, and real-time language translation. CUDA a compute unified device architecture allows software developers to use familiar programming languages like C, C++, and Python to write code that run on NVIDIA GPUs. CUDA provides libraries, APIs, and tools that abstract away the complexities of GPU programming, making it accessible to a wide range of developers. GPU programming is the process of writing software code to execute on graphic processor unit or GPU instead of the traditional CPU. GPUs are designed to excel at parallel processing, where many simple calculations can be done simultaneously, and this makes them ideal for tasks that require large number of computations to be done quickly, such as graphics rendering, scientific simulations, and importantly, AI and ML. Developers use these languages with CUDA for high-level AI ML model design to write highly optimized algorithms for tasks like image filtering, enhancement, object detection, and video encoding or decoding. This is crucial in applications like Adobe Photoshop, video editing software, and medical imaging. So let's explore a simplified example to illustrate how GPU programming with CUDA could be applied within Adobe Photoshop for image processing. Now, image blurring is a common operation in Photoshop, used for effects like softening edges or reducing noise. A simple blur algorithm involves averaging the pixel values around each pixel in the image. And implementing this on a GPU with CUDA can significantly accelerate the process. So in this code, global indicates a function that runs on the GPU. The kernel iterates over each pixel in the image using block ID X and thread ID X for parallelism. And for each pixel, it calculates a weighted average for its neighboring pixels using the provided kernel. 
which defines the blur strength and shape. And the result is then stored in the output image. Now, Photoshop could break down the image into smaller blocks and assign each block to a different GPU thread for parallel processing. The CUDA kernel would be executed on the GPU, performing the blurring operation much faster if it were done sequentially on the CPU. The blurred image data would then be transferred back from the GPU to the CPU for display and further editing. Image blurring with CUDA allows for near instantaneous results even on large images, making it ideal for interactive editing in Photoshop. This approach can be extended to more complex filters and effects, significantly speeding up Photoshop's performance. Now this is a simplified example. Real-world image processing in Photoshop involves much more complex algorithms and optimizations. However, it demonstrates the fundamental concept of how GPU programming with CUDA can be leveraged to dramatically enhance the performance and capabilities of softwares like Photoshop. Now the execution of CUDA code primarily happens on the GPU itself, which can be located in the developer machine. This is the most common scenario where developers install the CUDA toolkit in their own systems equipped with NVIDIA GPU. They can then write, compile and run their CUDA code directly on their local machine. Or it can be also located in the cloud. Cloud providers like AWS, GCP and Microsoft Azure offer virtual machines with NVIDIA GPUs. Developers can remotely access these VMs and execute their CUDA code on powerful cloud GPUs. The CUDA kernel we discussed here would indeed run on the end user graphics card when they use the blur feature in Photoshop. In essence, a CUDA kernel is a special kind of function that you write in language like C, C++ or Fortran, but it's designed to be executed on the GPU instead of the CPU. Think of it as a set of instructions tailored for the GPU's parallel processing architecture. The key distinction is that when you launch a CUDA kernel, it gets executed simultaneously by thousands of threads on the GPU cores. Each thread handles a small portion of the overall task, like blurring a specific region of the image. The massive parallelism is what makes GPUs so powerful for the tasks like image processing. The compiled CUDA code is often packaged into libraries, for example, DLS on Windows or SO files on Linux or Mac. They are included with the Photoshop installation. So, when the user selects the blur tool in Photoshop, Photoshop code loads the appropriate CUDA kernel library. The image data is transferred from the CPU to the GPU memory. Photoshop then launches the CUDA kernel and it runs in parallel on the GPU cores applying the blur effect to the image. The processed image data is transferred back from the GPU to the CPU, and then Photoshop displays the blurred image to the user. NVIDIA's GPUs are not just powering AI applications, they're also revolutionizing data centers. With significant investments in networking technologies like NVLink and InfiniBrand, NVIDIA enables high-speed communication between GPUs and servers, enhancing data center performance. Their drive platform offers a comprehensive solution for building self-driving cars. NVIDIA also plays a crucial role in developing the metaverse and 3D virtual worlds. The Omniverse platform supports real-time collaboration and simulation for creators, designers, and engineers. Now, while NVIDIA GPUs are known for their high performance, they come with a premium price tag, which can be a limiting factor for small companies or individual developers. Although NVIDIA currently leads the market, 